What's the aim of the CBI's campaign on taxation? The, campaign, the aim of the campaign is to begin to join the debate. As John Cridland said um, during his speech, this has been a one-sided debate so far. But that's in part the fault of business. Business has not made its own case. There is a very strong case to be made, in both in terms of the tax that we pay, but also in terms of moves which the government has made, and just a great change in the landscape over the past 10 years, which means that quite a lot of the abusive tax planning that people think that business gets up to simply doesn't happen anymore. Um, this is partly government moving in terms of the disclosure of tax avoidance schemes, for example, partly about the enhanced relationship, talking more uh, to businesses so that there's more real-time activity, so the problems actually don't arise in the first place, and also elevating this up to the boardroom. The courts have also taken a lot of action. Um, but I think it's important to note that companies have changed the way that they look at this as well. Uh, part of this is about the boardroom, but part of it also is also just about the general atmosphere. That's a story which hasn't been told. There have been people who've, who have uh, sort of made the case against us, uh, and we now need to start to make our own case, and that's what this campaign is about. But it has to be, it has to be a, uh, you know, a relatively uh, steady campaign. This is not something where we can just have a one-off, because this is something which is genuinely of public interest, uh, and it's something where business has to say, look, you know, yes, we're about growth, yes, we're about jobs, but yes, we do also play our part uh, in the tax system.